Hey, what's up, amigos? This is Joe Perez, host of Vamos al Mambo. Whether your project is inside your house, outside, on the lawn, or you're going on vacation, I'm going to help you tackle those projects. Let's give you a tip from time to time so you can enjoy those vacations. As you can see, it is time to cut the grass. Now, when we come back, I'm going to give you four basic tips so that you can have a nice looking grass lawn like the one behind me. Like I always say, Vamos al Mambo. Ding, 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 ding. three hours now that I've been out in the lawn cutting the grass it doesn't really take me that long when I'm cutting without filming but because I have to switch around the camera I was also as you can see flying the drone so you can see the aerial uh, view then it took me a long time anyway let's go to the basics tip number one cut your grass frequently I tend to cut my grass every three to four days that means twice a week but a minimum you're going to cut your grass once a week the reason for this is that you want to cut only the tip okay remember the rule do not cut more than one-third of the blade in order for you to avoid to cut that um, more than one-third then you have to cut frequently this is very very important okay and it goes along with watering which is tip number two one is not more important than the other they are actually very important uh, as equal if you water your lawn you're gonna see a green because it's not gonna be dry but if you don't cut it sooner or later it's gonna suffer okay you know why women go to the uh, beauty shop and cut those tips that's because they want they're here to grow uh, strong the grass is typical like that very similar cut only the tip sometimes I kid you not when I cut my grass I only cut about that much one fourth but then well now that's actually perhaps too much I actually sometimes even cut about 116 yes it's exaggerated but behind me are the results and you can see for yourself how is that grass how green and now it's in healthy don't forget to water your grass you need a minimum once a week a half inch of water space it out twice a week however when it comes to a drought here in Florida or the excessive heat it needs a little more water in the city where I live they don't allow us to water our grass more than uh, two times a week so we have to get in some extra watering then we can do that by hand with a hose but just remember that okay but again frequent cuts and tip number two water that grass tip number three you have to fertilize some people don't like to fertilize the lawn because it just makes it grow faster but hey if you want a green lawn and healthy lawn you have to fertilize okay whether it's well organized this one I um, I recommend this is organic if you are starting out and you don't know how to take care of your grass use this product that means it's a, going to be a slow release you're gonna see uh, results about uh, I would say it about uh, in a week 
um, and uh, it's a lot of uh, nitrogen, MPK. This is what uh, I am wanting to concentrate, number six. That's the end. That was the nitro, that's six percent. Okay, um, it's gonna get that green nice lawn that you are wanting, just like the one in neighbor. You can uh, compete and try to dominate that neighbor. Or for more advanced people, I also use my liquid sometimes, uh, fertilizer. Okay, and, but that will be another video, another series. I just picked up this one right here. I put it into the back. Um, this one here, I think it was a 35. Oh, there it is, a 35. Okay, but uh, it's got another uh, elements in the back there that I'm not really gonna uh, talk about, but that's not really true. Uh, 35 percent, it's kind of lower, but nevertheless, um, I think I saw results uh, in about a week and a half, two weeks. Uh, it it's it's a three and one. It feeds, it kills weeds, uh, and it prevents. So basically, it's like um, it's it's like a a pre-emergent, a post-emergent, and then also a fertilizer on a three and a one. However, a little slower. It treats up about uh, see what right, right here, ten thousand square feet. Um, however, uh, it's very slow though. Uh, so I'm still I'm still testing it. So far, after two weeks, I'm not really impressed uh, with it compared to other brands uh, that I've been using at Bars Commercial. Uh, but of course, I don't want to talk to you about that because it's a lot more expensive for you guys. And this is meant for the home owner that uh, really wants to get it done really quick and treat it uh, nicely. Okay? But remember, fertilize. Um, every four weeks to four, uh, six weeks, okay? Not sooner than that. This is the one that I recommend. Malogonite, once again, organic. If you make a mistake, if you put too much, it's not going to burn your lawn, okay? I, this is the products that I use. These are not sponsored. They're not paying me for that. This is what, um, what it works for me. All right, so if by any chance you have disease in your lawn, then you're going to use this one right here, Scott's brand, Disease X. I have a video that I posted about uh, six months ago where I show you uh, how to spread uh, this um, fungicide, okay? Um, this is going to help you get rid of those brown spots. It's going to get you that lawn that is uh, nice and healthy and it's a preventer and it's also going to cure it, all right? So the way that we're going to be doing this is we're going to spread this, for example, on a Sunday. Um, go ahead and put a half an inch of water after you apply this. Wait one week and then you're going to go ahead and hit it uh, the following Sunday with this other product right here. And that way you're going to do a double bullet like the lawn care nut uh, stays that's his creation right here okay but it works whatever this one doesn't help you with or doesn't tackle then this is going to go ahead and uh, resolve it all right so one week apart this is the combination that you're going to be doing uh, for your disease control that's when you get your brown spots and the leaves are starting to uh, turn to like yellow spots and brown spots, whether it's circular or whether it is the complete uh, leaf. This is what you need here. All right, amigos, I hope you liked the video. Just basic stuff to teach you how to take care of your grass. That way you will avoid to be messing your grass, killing your grass like I did years ago. If you like the video please subscribe hit that like button and also hit that bell so you'll be notified any comments or questions you know where to do it put them down below see you soon